Hello everyone, welcome back to Android Tips. In this video, we're going to talk about how to fix keyboard is not showing in your iPhone 14, 14 Pro, 14 Plus and even 14 Pro Max and how we can fix this up. So let's dive into the workaround. The first one is all about when you're having this issue, you need to check for any kind of updates. Just tap over here in the settings. Now from here, go to the general. Now from here, go to software update. So you need to check yourself whether you are having any pending updates or not. This is one of the main reasons. So if you're in the previous versions of software, which might be having bugs, so the Apple will be keep on rolling out some of the new updates you have to update. If you have to cross check whether you're having any update or not, that is the first one. So if you're having the update, the next step is all about you have to update it. So you have to update to the latest version of iOS and most probably when you do this up, the issue regarding this will be my most probably fixing up. If still the issue is not there and you have to try with the next one is all about, we can do a restart on your iPhone. So just go over here in the settings. Now from here, go to the general. Now keep scrolling down, go over here in the shutdown option and you can go over here and you can slide this off and you need to wait, you have to turn it on once again. And afterwards, you can see this. When you do this up, a restart. Sometimes a restart can fix a lot of issue. So you can try with a simple restart. That might work or may not work. You can try with this. Next one is all about afterwards. It's all about you can try with reset all settings on your iPhone. So it's a kind of like a factory reset. So you have to keep in mind, you should be taking all the data, should be completely backed up or you will be having a lot of trouble. So just go over here in the settings, keep scrolling down, tap over here in the general, go over here, transfer or reset iPhone, tap over here in the reset, and you can go for reset old settings. And also keep in mind, we can also go for erase old content and settings. You can try both. Because for some users, when they did erase old content and settings after taking a backup, complete backup, it worked for them. But few users tried with the reset, which all worked for them. So you can try both, you can go for reset old settings, and also after reset all setting, you can go over here and also you can do complete reset over here and that will be also working fine for you guys as well. So you can try this out as well. Next one is all about, we need to check the keyboard settings. So just go over here in the settings over here. Now just go to the general and from here you have to go to the keyboard. And now from here you have to make sure the auto capitalization and auto correction is turned on. You have to make sure this is turned on. As well as if you go over here, you have to make sure that it's everything is fine. And also, you have to keep in mind, there is one more step that I would like to add. So if you're using any third party keyboards, then you have to delete it. For deleting the same, you just need to follow the same. Go to settings, go to the general. Now from here in the keyboard, select this one from here. And if you find any keyboards over here, you can delete the respective keyboard, which are third party. Because for many users, when they deleted the third party keyboard, it worked for them. So you can try this out as well. Now, you won't have to try with all these steps. The issue is still persisting with you and you're having a lot of trouble. The last and the least one is all about you can do is you can completely do a forced restart like I said. Forced restart is actually not only a fix for this one, it's actually a fix for all the bugs or uh, issues which is happening in your iPhone. So just pro press volume up followed by volume down. Press and hold the power button over here and listen until you see the Apple logo. After doing with the forced restart, most probably the issue regarding with this particular keyboard is not showing will be completely fixed and you'll be good to go afterwards and you can type whenever you wanted to type with something will be working fine with everyone over here you can type everything without any issue over here and this is what you have to do and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out bye bye